Uh, well, um, just making a couple videos here uh, in quick succession. The first one I guess I'll take care of is the uh, the bearing situation here. This is a South Bend tool post grinder, and uh, bearings were shot in it. Um, the ones that came out of it are uh, standards. These were New Departure 87016s, and dimensions on those uh, one and three eighths and what is that I'll just let that go on there and then the interesting thing about these bearings is that the inner race is actually a little bit wider uh, than the outer so I'm not sure if I'm gonna run into trouble about that but then the inside diameter uh, it was like what was that, five eighths. Um, now, what's kind of fascinating is when you go into metric 35, 16, and 11. All right, pretty darn close. So, went online, tried to find these bearings, talked to uh, several bearing specialists, and these bearings are actually very difficult. To get a hold of they, these are obviously shot but even the new bearings um, first of all they're expensive the cheapest ones that I could find in this 870016 was like I think it was $17 that's not including shipping but uh, from a reputable bearing dealer they were I think $37 a piece and I was thinking that's that's kind of a lot right so with these dimensions being so similar and so close to metric dimensions what I did what I ended up doing was um, this is this actually killed me just a little bit, tore out a piece of my soul, but I did uh, turn down the spindle, the two bearing surfaces, down to uh, 15 millimeter, which then allows me to use a 6202 standard metric bearing in there, because the outside diameter is exactly the same on these two, and um, just had to turn it down one millimeter from 16 millimeters to 15 millimeters. And that, that works really well. The, the bearings fit into place and uh, everything is pretty smooth on that. So I just wanted to uh, give a quick update on that. And uh, now I'm going to do one about paint.